didn't take no roller blades, you son of a bitch. You didn't take no goddamn roller blades. You son of a bitch. <laughs> Hey, that's Elvis. My name is Jay V. Happy! Ha, ha. I'm going to guess the day. Thursday? No! No? Uh-uh. This is the longest week ever, it then. It's dragon. Oh, happy Friday to you. Almost. That'd be nice. Yeah. Uh, that there is a uh, junk face goon. You can tell by the, uh, you know, the junk hanging off his face. <laughs> Blah. And the goon from the... <laughs> <laughs> Matt on phones. Um... Waiting for Lou the Brain to uh, make an appearance, I guess. Back into the studio. No, he's, he's getting some for me. Okay, good. Here's the situation. Uh, we had an interview scheduled right for nine. Okay. And we told this lady, look, it's 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 going to be a little bit late. Can right. you hang in there? She's a doctor. Mm -hmm. And she's on this push to get the word out to black female americans especially mm. that you're more at risk of getting lung cancer mm. and she's saying this whole cold turkey thing there it is good yeah. job buddy this whole uh cold turkey thing right. doesn't work you got cold turkey week coming up you quit cold turkey right, and right. she says you know They're like 90 percent of people sure 99 probably right. something like that yeah, there's only one of people really that try to go cold turkey they go right back to smoking and i guess she's a doctor so she has all the answers all anyway right. um uh, if you remember a few months back when Con Ed really screwed up everything. Remember? Right. Yeah. Yes. This is all going to tie together. Just give me a shot here. Blackout. It was a blackout, man. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, Con Ed, they just looked like a bunch of idiots. Oh, I know. And nothing against you if you work for Con Ed. It's just, you know what I'm saying? You're yeah. idiots. Come on, get it. When it comes to you know, fixing things. Sure. Beyond anything beyond a Tinker Toy set, forget it. Maybe right. batteries so and a flashlight. So to show how incompetent they were, I came up with this character, and you know he he had no name, but he did. Uh, Hello, Connie. Right. And then uh, Elvis would be the guy, you know, complaining. Mm -hmm. So we want to keep that character yeah. now on the show. Of course. We na we actually named him right. Ed Conway, <laughs> off of Con Ed. Ah, sure. I like it. Ah, Good. Clever. So we couldn't talk to the lady live, but uh, I'll just give you since uh, O and A ran a little long, and it's cool they had uh, Jack Black yes. on. Yes. Um, Tenacious D. Genius. I'm saying it's cool, like you know. Yeah. I'm like anyone needs my approval. Yeah. Wasn't that Who a good one? You? Yeah, you're nothing. I suggest you shut your mouth. <laughs> uh, anyway, so we were in the next room uh, trying to get a hold of the doctor. Yeah. I would like to play that for you anyway. Okay. It would have been better live, but F it. Of course. Let's see here. Uh, it's all pre recorded. There it is. How you doing there, baby? Strong. Good morning, studio. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for Kimberly Jeffrey Leonard. Yep, I have her on the line. Is this JV and Elvis? Yes. Okay, perfect. I'll Thanks a lot. Through. Thanks, buddy. Mm -hmm. Doctor, you there? Yes, I'm here. Doctor Leonard, hello. Hello, how are you? Hi there. You were scheduled to be on with uh, JV and Elvis. This is Elvis. How are you? Hi, Elvis. I'm good. Good, good, good. If it's okay, I'm going to pass it along to our afternoon drive guy. His name is uh, Ed Conway. Okay. Okay, and uh, Ed, you ready? Okay, this is uh, Ed Conway. Ed, you're on with Kimberly Jeffrey Leonard. She's a smoking cessation expert. Go ahead, Ed. Uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the program. Uh, she has a Ph.D. Her name is Kimberly Jeffrey Leonard. Hello, how are you? I'm uh, doing very fine. Good, thank you for having me. It's no problem. I was uh, reading a, a little bit about this uh, uh <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're really let's, excited uh, about the let's, Don't Go Cold Turkey Week. Hold on, let me uh, just, let's start over because that was a glitch. Okay. Oh, okay. Do you mind, Miss Leonard? No, I don't mind. Okay. At all. Okay. His name's Ed Conway. He's going to start over with you. Here we go in three, two, one. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I would like you to uh, please welcome to the show uh, Kimberly Jeffries Leonard. She is a PhD, which would be a doctor. I uh, want to welcome you to the program, first of all. Thank you. You know, I was reading a little bit about this, and it says here, uh, this very, very, very interesting stat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's some interesting I lost it there. Quit laughing. <laughs> uh, yeah, it says, uh, let me read it right here. About 70% of smokers want to quit, and up to 45% of them are going to try in, in any given year, but if they try cold turkey, ninety percent will fail. That's that is true. interesting. That is really interesting. Yeah, that's true. Um, if you, Where do you get you your data? 
or, or data. Some people call it data. Others call it data. Uh, where, where do you get your data? Uh, what? Try it back. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's the laughing. No, I think it's your voice, too, dude. It's back on the memory. Give me a break. It's not my laughing. Yeah, we were looking for Kimberly Jeffrey Leonard, please. Oh, you know, we disconnected. We just felt like the interview was going. You know, there was a crossover from another studio um, that was playing into the same uh, on the same pot. The you know the the same channel. Okay. Could we get her back on real quick? You know, what? we've already disconnected, unfortunately. Now, could you tell me some of the negatives to smoking? <laughs> Hi there, yeah, we were uh, just doing an interview with Kimberly Jeffrey Leonard, and we were disconnected. Okay, hold on, please. Thank you. And you're from where? Uh, WFNY in New York. Hold on, please. Thanks. Example, we work with one farm that was a traditional... Hello? Yes, hi there. Hi, who's this? This is uh, Elvis of WFNY. We're trying to get back on with Dr. Leonard. Yeah, unfortunately, we're not going to... Okay, is there anybody... It's, just, it's heading in a direction that's completely inappropriate for the... Okay, is there anybody I could talk to about this, about the smoking cessation? I don't know. Not from our end. Okay, do you smoke? You know what? Even if I did, I wouldn't let you know. Wow. I, one time I stuck my d*** in a turkey. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's some good stuff. And... Oh. Oh. Yeah, hi, how are you? Lovely, how are you? Good, yeah, um, we were disconnected with Dr. Leonard. Oh, hold on one second. Oh, hold on, uh, can you tell me what's going on there? Because we, we're having trouble getting back in touch with her. Um, I'm actually in the office, I okay. can transfer you to the studio. Can okay, do you know anything about smoking cessation at all? It, I need to put you into the studio, this is the office line, hold on oh, one second. Oh, okay, okay, great. Original cropland. Then Crap that land. Be our recommendation to, to use it for those purposes. Of course, there are those tangible. Things. Hello. Yeah, Bob Binderwine. No, you know what? You're completely inappropriate. Um, excuse me. This is me. a public affairs topic, and it's not yes. funny at all. Um, this is Bob Binderwine. I'm calling for a Dr. Leonard, please. Yeah, and uh, while you're getting her, I think I'll have another smoke. I had a lot of questions too. <laughs> Jesus Christ! This is public affairs. You know I actually have her cell number. Oh, terrific. I have, the, it. I have the doctor's Dr. personal Leonard. cell number. Sweet. Dial her up. Direct to it. <laughs> Hi, you rich key cell phone. Please leave me a message. I'll return your call as soon as I can. Thanks. Uh, yes, hello, this is uh, Ed Conway. Uh, we got disconnected. I was hoping we could do an interview on the uh, cold turkey. No cold turkey. Let's say no cold turkey. This ain't no cold turkey anymore. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Listen, what I'm trying to do, uh, uh, I'm a musician, uh, not just a radio host, but I was going to see if I could help you guys out with a little jingle or something like that. So uh, let me try another song for you. If you like it, you can give me a call back. Turkey for you. Turkey for me. One time I gave a little turkey with EG. You can reach me at 212-345-F***. <laughs>